is Dr. Julian De Silva. I'm a facial cosmetic surgeon based in London. And the question I've been asked to answer, has there been an increased demand for Middle Eastern patients coming to London for facial cosmetic procedures? Certainly from my experience, there certainly has been an increase in demand. And I think there are a number of reasons why patients are increasingly coming to London in order to have facial procedures. I think firstly is patient safety. And we have a very high quality of safety for all uh, pr all locations and facilities that provide facial cosmetic surgery and that is because there's a very tight regulation by the Care Quality Commission and the Care Quality Commission accredit all facilities in order to ensure that the patient's safety is the number one priority and I can tell you that the criteria in order to have these, the, the, this facility is, is very stringent and provides patients with the assurance that they're getting a very high quality of care where safety is the number one concern. And I think a lot of Middle Eastern patients feel comfortable with the fact that they're traveling to a, a worldwide center in which they're getting the highest quality of care and the highest quality level of service. Secondly, I think the, one of the reasons patients come to see me as a facial cosmetic surgeon is that they are getting a very high quality care and that they're getting an expert who is able to give them natural looking results. And Middle Eastern patients have certain characteristics as a result of their genetics and the environment in which they live that, that require an attention to detail in order to ensure that any surgery that they undergo gives them a natural looking result. And so when talking about the eyes, there's certain characteristics such as the almond shape of the eye, the, the position of the skin crease, the changes that occur with age, all of these characteristics need to be taken into account in order to give the patient the most optimal surgery and give them a natural looking result. Another example would be rhinoplasty and certain characteristics of Middle Eastern patients such as large noses, a large bump or slightly bulbous tip, these characteristics are important in into taking into account with surgery in order to preserve one's ethnicity but still give them a natural looking result that they're looking for. And for me, my goal is to give them surgery that often their own friends and family will have difficulty telling they've had surgery because it looks natural. And in addition to this, other qualities with um, Middle Eastern patients is the relative thickness of the skin over their nose. And Generally speaking, the, th the thickness tends to be slightly greater, which makes patients more prone to swelling after surgery. And I will use specific anti-inflammatory medications in my Middle Eastern patients in order to speed up their recovery and get them back to doing their normal activities as soon as possible. And all of the all of the surgery is very much tailored towards the individual in order to give them those natural looking results. I think the, th the, the other reason why Middle Eastern patients come to, to London is I find that a lot of these patients are very busy in their schedules and have difficulty in finding time in order to recover. And coming to a city such as London, which is very cosmopolitan, has a lot of people who live from all parts of the world, enables patients to recover in a relaxed environment, as well as getting the best possible results in this, in, in, with, the, with the fastest recovery possible. And I think in the future, the number of patients traveling from the Middle East to London to have surgery is only going to increase as a result of the reasons that I mentioned.